10 Proven Ways to Speed Up Weight Loss A gym membership and healthy food are luxuries that, unfortunately, not everyone can afford. And of course, there are those who can, but are simply too busy or lazy to put in the time and effort. As a result, obesity rates tripled between 1975 and 2017, with about 1.9 billion adults across the world seriously struggling with their weight. The good news is that there are some simple yet proven ways to make weight loss a lot easier and way more effective. Number 10. Eat before eating Definitely not how you thought a video about weight loss would start, is it? Let me explain. This point is all about when and what you eat. Researchers at Penn State University have found that having a bowl of soup before a meal can help curb your appetite. This is likely due to the fact that you have to eat hot soup slowly, so this gives your brain and stomach enough time to coordinate a message of fullness. Plus, all foods have different satiety levels depending on their form, temperature, and energy content. It turns out that soup, whether it's liquidy, chunky, or pureed, beats the competition when it comes to boosting your energy and leaving you satisfied after a meal. Number 9. Spice up your food Do you like your food on the spicy side? If so, then this tip will be music to your ears. Uh, tongue. Eating spicy food can temporarily boost your metabolism by up to 8%, thereby increasing your body's calorie burning rate. It's also been found to encourage people to eat slowly, which is good for your metabolism too. According to Jacqueline London, senior clinical dietitian at Mount Sinai Hospital in New York, spices have anti-inflammatory properties and add a flavor that contributes to the feeling of fullness in your belly. But with a sea of spices to choose from, how can you find the ones that will help you lose your gut the most? Well, you could try on these fantastic spicy four. Chili powder that's rich in capsaicinoids takes more energy to process than other food, making you eat slower. It can also affect your dietary preferences and send you over to the plant side. Ground ginger brings blood sugar levels back to normal, which is really important for weight stability. You could try sprinkling it on your stir fries or even adding it to Greek yogurt. The Indian spice we all love in curry dishes, turmeric, combats fat cells by preventing their growth and making them smaller. Finally, the strong smell of garlic powder will make you eat slower and in smaller bites, which will stop you from overeating and help speed up your metabolism. Number 8. Eat healthy snacks Eat more, but not at mealtimes. Yep, you heard that correctly. One of the biggest mistakes people who want to lose weight make is stretching the time between their meals. While this might sound logical, it actually ends up making you feel completely starved before every meal, so you eat more in one sitting. You're also more likely to eat fast, which is something that's definitely not recommended. Keep healthy snacks like sunflower seeds, almonds, spiced apples, mixed nuts, whole wheat crackers, Greek yogurt with berries, and low-fat cheese on hand, and eat them every few hours. And fresh vegetables come in all kinds of varieties, such as cucumbers with hummus, kale chips, or celery sticks. Who said your healthy snack has to be bland and boring? Number 7. Sleep more I bet you'll love this one. It turns out that sleeping more can actually prevent you from putting on unwanted pounds. Getting proper rest is really important for your body to function well. A study at the University of Colorado Boulder found that people on a diet consumed 6% fewer calories when they got enough sleep. The experiment went like this. 16 young, healthy adults spent two weeks at the university's hospital, which was a special sleep suite. Sounds pretty sweet, right? At first, all of them got nine hours of sleep a night and a nice square meal to feed them. They were then split into two groups, the first of which got only five hours of shut-eye. Members in the group spent more energy staying awake and started overeating at mealtimes. Think of that the next time you decide to stay up late and watch TV or surf the web. Number 6. Drink a lot of tea You know the cliché, drink 8 glasses of water a day. Of course, you really should be drinking water, but only when you're thirsty. For other occasions, tea, particularly the green kind, is a better option because it contains a ton of antioxidants that can help you lose weight. If you want any proof of that, just note that green tea, along with water, is the beverage of choice in many Asian countries. They've been taking advantage of it for centuries, and it obviously helps them to stay slim. As an additional benefit, green tea helps protect the body against cancer, too.
Number 5. Embrace the color blue. We all know that wearing certain colors can make you look thinner or bigger. Well, it turns out that the color of your plate has a similar effect on your appetite, increasing or decreasing it. Researchers at the Oxford University have found that people tend to eat less when there's a higher color contrast between their plate and the food on it. The participants of the experiment tried sweet and salty popcorn from white, blue, green, and red bowls. They noticed the salty popcorn tasted sweeter when it was in the blue and red bowls, and the sweet one seemed saltier when eaten from the blue bowl. The lower the contrast between the plate and its contents, the more food you'll want to serve yourself. Scientists have also found that people eat 33% less in a blue room. Blue is known to calm you down, physically lower your heart rate, and actually decrease your appetite. No wonder McDonald's, KFC, and Burger King use hunger-provoking red instead of calming blue in their restaurant decor. Number 4. Stop Multitasking If you're one of those people who can have their lunch, finish up a last-minute report for work, and chat on the phone with their spouse or a friend all at the same time, you might want to break this bad, though quite impressive, habit. When you multitask, your mind bounces from one job to another, but doesn't really focus on any one of them, and that includes thoughts of food. This can make you forget that you're on a diet, so you'll unconsciously dig deeper into your snack drawer. People also tend to eat faster and in bigger quantities when they aren't fully concentrated on enjoying the process of eating. Number 3. Laugh Having a good laugh sesh prolongs your life and gives you a mini aerobic workout. It causes the heart to beat faster, which increases blood circulation in the body. Intense laughter for about an hour burns almost as many calories as weightlifting for 30 minutes. We know this thanks to the research led by Dr. Helen Pilcher, who's both a neuroscientist and a comedian. She would definitely know a thing or two about laughter and its effects on the body. Number 2. Sleep in the Cold When we sleep in lower temperatures, the body burns the brown fat stored in the belly in order to keep itself warm. In order to burn this fat, the body needs heat, so it cranks up the metabolic rate. The medical journal Diabetes published the results of a study on this topic carried out by the National Institutes of Health. The participants of the experiment spent several nights in climate-controlled bedrooms. The research showed that people who slept in rooms with a temperature of around 66 degrees burned 7% more calories than those who slept in warmer rooms. The facts speak for themselves. Number 1. Turn off the lights It might sound a little weird and random, but it's true. Researchers at The Ohio State University found that sleeping in dark places can slim the body down. When I say dark, I mean pitch black, so no phones or tablets before going to bed. And turn that TV and computer screen completely off. I know it's harsh, but think of the results. Total darkness is important for your body to produce enough metabolism-boosting hormones to help you slim down in no time. What helps you personally lose weight? Do you have any secret tips you'd like to share? Tell us in the comments below.